NRL Fanatics here back today with a video and this is some breaking news just broke not long ago and this is regards to Warriors winger Ken Mamalo now I did a video a couple days ago you know talking about reports around Ken Mamalo set to leave the Warriors at the end of this season now it has been officially confirmed by the club that Ken Mamalo has requested and been granted an immediate release from his contract this season. So he's been officially released. Now it says here uh, from the Warriors uh, website, I'll just read a bit of it. It says here, the 26-year-old Kiwi international who was signed to the end of next season will continue his career with another NRL club. And it says here via Vodafone Warriors CEO Cameron George says here, Ken had an opportunity to secure a long-term future for himself and his family family beyond next season, but we couldn't offer anything further at this stage, says the Vodafone Warriors CEO Cameron George. He has made a huge contribution to the Vodafone Warriors and we wish him and his family all the best for the future. So yeah, it says here, so Ken Mamalo, look, his career, you know, it all started out with the under-20 side in 2014, where he won a, a premiership there, and then he made his NRL debut against the Parramatta Eels in the opening round of the 2015 NRL season. He finished his career with 41 tries in his Warriors career. So, you know, what? I'm not surprised by this news. I'm not shocked at all. It was coming. Now, you know, I was hoping that, you know, the reports were like just reports. But, you know, I've got mixed feelings on this. I've got mixed views on it. Now, a lot of people probably happy that he's gone. You know, a lot of people are happy he's gone because, you know, the last couple of years, Ken's had a very quiet last couple of years, which, you know, I understand completely. I do agree on some point of that. But also, you know, you've got to remember the positives that Ken Mamala has bring to the club, not the negatives, not talk about the negatives. You know, he's brought a lot of positives to this club. Now, Ken Mamala, you know, he had a great couple of years at the club. You know, the year he stood out the most was that year he won the Ken Irvine medal where he won the, uh, you know, top try scorers award. He was top try scorers in the NRL. Now, after that, Ken Mamalo, look, I believe this year has been a bit of a quiet year for Ken from his strandings, but, you know, he's he's still been... He's still a decent player. And, you know, if, if he can get that consistency, Ken Mamala, you know, he can be one of the best swingers in the game, I believe. I believe strongly that he can be one of the best swingers in the game. But in terms of Ken, you know, being released, you know, it's not surprising. Now, the NRL club that has confirmed they've signed him, you know, straight after this release, you know, that they were talking about, is the West Tigers. Now, the West Tigers have come out and confirmed they've signed Ken Mamalo, which I think is great, you know. Not surprising because Michael Maguire, you know, he's a Kiwis coach and he works for the West Tigers. So, you know, he will have a relationship with Ken Mamalo. He'll have a, you know, player and coach relationship with him. So, not surprising that he's not going to the West Tigers. And um, I'd like to wish him all the best. And, you know, I'd like to thank Ken Mamalo for what he's done at the club, what he's brought to the club, you know. Look at the positives. He has brought some great stuff to the club, Ken Romalo. And, you know, his strike, weight, his strike rate is not too bad, actually. His strike rate is not too bad. You know, he scored a couple of tries. Now, you know, Manu Vatavai was probably one of his idols growing up, you know. you know, And he's um, Tongan as well, Ken Romalo. So, yeah, I mean, look, Ken Romalo has come through the system. He's done quite well, you know. Not, they're not, not his best couple of years, but, you know, Still got to remember what he's done well for the club, you know, look at the positives and what he's brought to the club. And, you know, I've got, I'm also a little bit gutted and sad, you know, but I'm also not surprised, but I also am happy for him at the same time because, you know, if he goes to another club, finds his potential, you know, hopefully he can bring that potential into the international arena. So, absolutely surprised that, you know, the Tigers have signed him, but I'm not surprised that he's leaving. So, yeah, I mean, all the best to Ken Mamalo. I'd like to thank him for what he's done at the Warriors. You know, still a warrior at heart. All the best to Ken and, yeah, um, good luck to him for the future at the West Tigers. So, 
Yeah, let me know in the comment section below what are your thoughts on this breaking news that Ken is released from his contract and heading to the West Tigers this year. Let me know in the comment section what are your thoughts? What are your thoughts on Ken Mamalo's career at the Warriors? Do you think, you know, he had some good times? Do you think, you know, he could have stayed on longer and fulfilled his potential a bit better? Let me know in the comment section below. But like I said, you know, all the best to Ken and his family. You know, good luck to him and hopefully he does well at his new club, but not too well when he comes up against us. So, yeah, make sure you give your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget as well to also hit that like button on the video. And also, if you're new around here and you're watching this video, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Hit that red subscribe button down below. It doesn't cost a thing. It's free. Just hit that subscribe button to show your support for this channel. And let's get to 600 subscribers in the next couple of weeks. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. And I'll see you all in the next one.